Hello, artists. Today, we are going to draw a bowl of ice cream. I am going to start with a big U shape. It is like an upside down rainbow. I am going to add a line to the top to make the curve on the top of my bowl. Notice it's not a straight line, it's a curve. Down at the bottom, I am adding a fancy bottom to my bowl. I added two lines and connected them. I'm adding some more straight lines to make it a little fancier. I am even going to decorate my bowl. So I'm going to make a stripe that I could color later if I want to. I am going to leave a little bit of space on the side of my bowl and make a curved line for my scoop of ice cream. I'm going to make another one on the other side, but I'm going to stop so I don't run into the other scoop. One more rainbow line makes my last scoop on top. I am adding a curved line in the back to show that my ice cream is in the bowl. Remember, you can always pause the video to catch up or to look at something more closely. I am going to add a wavy line for some syrup. Maybe it's chocolate or strawberry or caramel. It's your ice cream, so it's up to you. I think my sauce is going to be dripping all over the place. I am erasing a small part of my line on top so that I can add a circle for a cherry. I love cherries on my ice cream. I think that is my favorite thing about sundaes. Now I am going to add small ovals for sprinkles. This is another detail that you can decide to add or not. Right now, my ice cream is floating on the page. I am going to make two straight horizontal lines that come out from the side on the left and the right to make the table. Now it's time to decide what flavors are your ice cream. I'm adding some shapes that could be chocolate or maybe pieces of fruit. I added some wavy lines for some swirls and then I am going to trace with my Sharpie. Remember, tracing with a Sharpie is up to you. I like to trace with a Sharpie so that my lines really stand out when I color. If you have coloring materials at home, now would be a great time to use them. I'm using crayons to fill my page with color. You could use markers, colored pencils, or even paint if you have those things at home. I am adding decorations to my table and also the background. Here are some sprinkles and also a can of whipped cream. Here's my ice cream. I hope you had fun with yours.